Boosie throwing shots at Rollo. Look, he called Rollo a snitch. Look, Rollo got out, bro. Uh, Fam Goon was pushing a lot of work, bro. And he was able to get out after a few years of sitting in there and fighting this case. He was able to get out. Now, they saying Rollo snitch. I just know about Rollo buying back the hood, bro. Look, until y'all buy back the hood, man, leave Rollo alone, bro. He trying, man. I don't know what Rollo snitched. Maybe they know a little more in Atlanta. I don't know. You know what I mean? But they saying Boosie shit snitched on the security guard. Look, whether you tell a, 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 a big lie or a small lie or a big truth or a small truth to the authorities, bro, it's snitching or something, bro. So let's just be honest, man. All this old red tape on who's snitching, who's not. Man, at this point, I don't even care, bro. I don't even care, man. If he buy the hood back as a snitch, he buy it back as a snitch, man. At least he buying back black. Am I right or wrong, bro? Drop it in the comments. Wiz Khalifa charged with drug possession in Romania. Look, the man had 18 grams. On top of that, they said he smoked a handmade, hand rolled cigarette on stage. If you don't know, Romania, it's, to it's illegal to possess marijuana or smoke it. Yeah, yeah. Up to 10 years in prison. Uh, they give you a little fine. I don't, they always say that, bro, like, you're going to get locked up. Or bro, something's going to happen, and Wiz is not going to do a day in jail out there, bro. They arrested him. He went in. He got out before they even took his laces. Let's just be honest about it, bro. It's just a little green. What's going on in the world? Uh, they keep their people all mind fucked that you're getting 10 years for some weed. Don't book Wiz, bro. Don't book Wiz in Romania if you know Wiz is a marijuana rapper, bro. Let's just be honest. Cussed out realities, bro. It, you know it's going to be some smoke up there. Now nah, it's lighter crowd and it's like the 60s. You're getting arrested on stage. Come on, man. Don't go back out there, Wiz. Bosco 100 throwing shots at Buster Rhymes. He said, it is funny, bro. I've never seen Buster Rhymes with no woman. Buster Rhymes getting dragged for being zesty. Everybody's starting to believe it. Why? Because we never seen him with no woman. Why we ain't never seen you with no woman, Buster? Other than like in a Janet Jackson video with the Mariah Carey. I don't even think he ever messed with them women. You know, he ain't no play with the women. You know what I mean? Is it only fanboys? Women. If you women that mess with Buster Rhymes ever mess with him in a sexual way, get in the comments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People want to say, why does he have to say? Look, this is the entertainment industry, people. Everything is up for grabs. It's all news, bro. If something's going on with these entertainers, they get paid to divulge every little bit of information about themselves. It is no privacy. Bust around, all your zesty. Why we ain't never seen you with no woman? Inquiring minds just want to know, bro. Yeah, yeah, because we growing up now. We want to know the truth about you people. That's why. Come on, man. J. Prince Jr. was robbed five times, allegedly, in Los Angeles. According to WAC 100, this is why J. Prince don't get in the West Coast business. Why? Because they said he can't handle it. According to WAC 100, J. Prince Jr. was robbed in L.A. five times. Look, Jr., bro, why even go out there? You know what I mean? If you ain't welcome out there, you getting robbed every time you touch ground. Why go out there, bro? This is when you bring the vibe to your own city that you're looking for out there. And you, I got to go collect money. I got to go do this. The people don't want you out there, bro. You know what I mean? They don't own the land. So if you're going to go, go with a, come on, man. Go with a little light military, bro. Y'all got the money. Raw five times. Like, you giving them bragging rights like that? Whack 100, you're from Pacoima. You're not from L.A. But I respect Whack 100. If he said it happened, I'm not obliged to think it happened until somebody come out and say it didn't happen. J. Prince Jr., was you raw five times in L.A., bro? What? 42 Doug defends Eminem's legacy. In Detroit, look, Skiller Baby said people in Detroit don't jam him and he's not the best rapper from Detroit. He put a lot of other people on the list. Uh, I don't know about that. I think Eminem is the best rapper from Detroit for sure. All that old Big Sean's better and all this. Man, y'all stop with the gas, bro. 42 Doug, he being real. He just letting you know the youngsters. You can't blame them because they don't know him like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Him being in the shadows for a minute. The new kids don't know him. The new generation don't know him. So they think this and this go harder. But no, if you from Detroit, bro, drop it in the comments, man. If you from Detroit, bro, Michigan, who goes harder than Eminem from Michigan, bro? Let's just be real. It's Michigan. You know what I mean? T Grizzly hard, but he ain't that hard, bro. He's straight. 
Teddy Bear ass nigga. He, he good. The NFL squad in Houston had him shut down. You know, he real. Lil Wayne defends Drake, Amir, Kendrick Lamar. Battle, scuffle, whatever they got going on, bro. It ain't really even important. You know what I mean? People think OVO ain't shit. Wayne holding up his chain, showing you OVO is something. They don't like us. You know what I mean? I don't know what's going on. The world picking K Dot over Drake, TDE over YMCMB. Y- Look, y'all tripping, bro. Now, when the music really start to pop off and you're not hearing nothing from K-Dot, stay on that side. Because what we ain't going to do is we ain't going to go against Wayne. Uh, They say, wow, Wayne, Wayne, Wayne. Look, Wayne is top five, bro. Wayne is top. Wayne is number one. Let's put it there. You know what I mean? Everybody going to say Eminem, Jay-Z. Say what you say. But give me that bomb beat from Dre and let me serenade the streets of L.A. Yeah, yeah, Wayne got it, bro. And that was a Tupac line, but that's just how we do it, bro, on this show. You know what I mean? It is what we said it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wayne taking up a drink. We already seen that happen in Playboy. Oh, that Blackthorn shots at Plies. Look, Plies criticized Trump after Trump survived the assassination. Plies said, we not going for no Trump slander. None of it. Uh, if you don't know... Trump pardoned uh, Kodak Black and Kodak Black a loyal motherfucker, bro. Yeah, you ain't saying nothing about Trump. He ain't, look, Plies, I, Plies make a lot of good points, bro. Plies make a lot of good points. He said the assassination attempt, attempt was uh, fake. He said Donald Trump made all this happen, made this up. You know what I mean? Well, somebody really died, Plies. Something really happened. And I don't think nobody would let somebody graze their neck with a sniper rifle. You dig? So I don't know. I don't know what Plies talking about. I just know I'm with Yak on this one. You know what I mean? If Yak say he got his back, man, we do too, bro. We riding. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Lead Trump alone. He like the new Tupac of the uh, presidential election, bro. He's winning. Sorry, Biden. Cameron throwing shots at Jay Prince. Look, Mace lined him up, bro. I thought Mace did said enough. You know what I mean? But Cam still had to spit on it a little bit. You know what I mean? No diddy. Uh, yeah, he's showing them what they do in Harlem, bro. They not for the shit. He ain't with J. Prince games. J. Prince said he taking all bets and fakes. Well, Cameron say, what's up? I don't know what that means, but I'm taking all bets too, nigga. Let's line it up. You know what I mean? Yeah. At some point, this 2024, so J. Prince going to have to show. Only person I really knew was really scared of J. Prince was zero. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That man had zero uh, career on a, on a fish hook. You know <laughs> Every time D Row would try to run away, nigga would really that back in. You know what I mean? So that's the only person I ever seen really scared of Jay Prince. But look, I'm gonna tell you right now, these Harlem boys ain't for it. I knew Cameron wasn't for it anyway. If you know anything about Cam, man, Cam ain't chipping, bro. And he's six four, ready to swing on something, ready to punch something out. That's in Harlem, bro. Come on, man. Oh, Jamar throwing shots at Lil Uzi Vert. Look, he said uh he was an honest man that just went to the extreme for the Illuminati. He was straight at first honest intentions and something just happened to him down the line. I ain't never really been the biggest Lil Uzi Vert fan. I just know Lord Jamar, uh, he got some points, bro. The man really talking about everybody. Maybe he was the first Cat Williams because Lord Jamar been around. Let's just be honest. You know what I mean? Lil Uzi Vert, I don't know what point is he pushing. He always got a purse, always got the nails. It's 2024. That's all I can say, bro. We don't judge people. Lil Uzi, do your thing. The man got a lot of fans. I don't even think Lil Uzi gay. I just think he just be tugging on the old fence. You know what I mean? I don't know, bro. I don't stay around long enough to even figure that part of the game out. If y'all going to figure it out, figure it out, bro. Lil Uzi, do your thing, bro. Lord Jamar, you wearing Hoochie Daddy shorts too, cuz. So I don't know what you talking about, bro, with all the homo shit. We think it's in you too, bro. For real, man. Mace throwing shots at Jay Prince. Look, Mace said he ain't with the bullshit, bro. Um, Jay Prince, hella selective, allegedly. Uh, didn't tell K Dot and TDE shit when it comes to Shakur Stevenson. He talk about taking fades and taking bets. Well, look, you can't play with them Harlem boys like that. No. <laughs> look, Mace showed the fire. I ain't never seen Mace with this fire, but it was hella impressive. And you got to put some respect on that man's name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Show that little something, bitch, how y'all does it up in Harlem, boy. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you ain't seen it, bro, this is the first time I ever seen Jay Prince really get put in this place. I don't know if Jay Prince will respond. I just know Mace ain't the one. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Mace ain't the one. Uh, Mace, good job, bro. I, I've never witnessed nobody tell Jay Prince off better. You know what I mean? Mace said he has no big homie. He don't respect none of that shit. And he lost all respect that he did have for Jay Prince because he's 60 years old and still want to play the street cards. Mace ain't for it. He say that's what always got him in trouble because he never respected the street cats. Look, the man took the words out of my mouth, bro. Uh, I know Jay Prince, of course. I'm in Houston, you know what I mean? But, hey, I'm Houston to Harlem. Everybody know New York Chris, you know what I mean? Go look it up, bro. Jam the songs. Look, you can't be biased when it comes to this real shit, you know what I mean? Mace, yeah, Mace got his name back, bro. If they throw it, I'ma catch it to play the game like Tetris. I'm one of a kind rap, people tell me I'm a clip. I've been working 24 hours, summertime to win them. I ain't really at the chili, got a 